Welcome to MarcusG.TV. I am Chef Marcus Julian. I'm a chef on a mission. Today's mission is shrimp seafood. Been a, I've been passionate about seafood for years upon years. That was really, you know, one of the things uh, that I, as a young chef, I really gravitated toward was seafood cookery. So all different types of seafood I've studied for years. And back in the late 90s, I got involved in sustainable seafood. So a lot of this I've been preaching since back then. So ABC News just recently came out with a, with a new with an with an article with a, with a segment on how contaminated shrimp is coming out of Asia and India, and I've said this for years. They're farmed in small dense densities. Um, it's big farms, small densities, and they use a lot of chemicals. ABC went in and got samples out of several grocery stores, and they found out that it is contaminated with. So there's residuals of banned antibiotics. Some of these antibiotics have been banned for 40 years and they've been linked to cancer. So they're saying, ABC News came out and said, don't, you know, don't, we don't recommend you buy that type of shrimp, which is a lot of the shrimp. It's actually 90% of the shrimp on the market. So when you go into the grocery store, go into a restaurant, that's what you're most likely getting. It's cheap shrimp. I see my vendors, I see them selling it, I see it in the grocery stores, I can recognize it. It's disgusting. It's pumped with chemicals, preservatives, and antibiotics. It's disgusting. So ABC News goes on further to say, you need to buy shrimp from the Gulf of Mexico. The Gulf shrimp are the best shrimp. Did they not miss the oil spill? I mean, come on, ABC. This oil spill was major. And where did the oil go? There's supposedly tar balls washing up. These, they're toxic tar balls. I, I've, I've seen um, reports about that, how they test these tar balls. They're, they're toxic. They're filled with chemicals. They pumped massive amounts of chemicals into the Gulf to combat the oil. So... It, the Gulf is polluted. I don't care what the Louisiana Seafood Council and all these seafood councils, that's their job is to promote the seafood down there. And all these chefs that say, I'm not afraid of the seafood. I wouldn't touch anything out of the Gulf personally. It'll never be the same. That much oil, that many chemical chemicals goes into the water like that. It'll never, ever be the same. Who knows if it's still leaking? We're not told the truth all the time on all this. It's disgusting. But the bottom line is I've never supported wild caught Gulf shrimp to begin with because in most cases, they're all trawl caught where they rake the bottom of the ocean and then, you know, destroy everything, bycatch, and the environment is totally destroyed. And the bycatch is immense, sometimes 7 to 15 pounds of unwanted fish for one pound of shrimp that we eat. So I've never been an advocate of that. So ABC News, you kind of have it wrong. If you go to Monterey Bay Aquarium or go to Fish Choice, Fish Choice is great, fishchoice.com. Type in the shrimp you're looking for. It'll give you the sustainability ratings based upon population, um, catch methods. All different things are factored into there. Um, personally, me, for shrimp, you know, I want farm shrimp, but I want it from certain places like Ecuador. Um, Mexico's even doing a great job. But each farm is individualized, especially when you go to Fish Choice. You can look up all the individual farms. The bottom line is if you want to eat shrimp, you've got to pay more for shrimp. Shrimp is one of those things where it's, there's so much cheap stuff out there because 90% of the stuff, like I said, is imported cheap shrimp that I will never, ever touch shrimp in a, in a restaurant, in a grocery store. I would never eat it. And if anybody asked me, I would tell them to stay away from it. You know, you want to pay premium, premium dollars for shrimp and make sure it's right. Go to fishchoice.com, check it out, do your research. And when you go to restaurants, tell them you don't want the cheap stuff because that's what they're buying. It's exactly what they're buying. I've seen, it for time. I've seen it for years, the cheap shrimp. Every seafood show I go to, every fish or food show, it's cheap shrimp, cheap shrimp, cheap shrimp, cheap shrimp. That's all that it is. I pay a lot more for my shrimp at my restaurant. Um, so um, if you like shrimp, do some research, email me. If you like this video, hit cl cl click, hit like or subscribe, share it, pass it on. I appreciate it. Thank you guys very much for watching.